I'm pleased to welcome Dr. Sveta Karelski, the Chief of Otolaryngology at Highland Hospital, to the program. Doctor, good morning. Thanks for a few minutes. Good morning. Thank you, Mark. So we're talking about the Inspire device uh, and it's, our, its ability to help our sleep. Before we talk about the device, what is it designed to help with? Well, Mark, obstructive sleep apnea is a very common condition in which um, our breathing during sleep is interrupted due to obstruction or collapse of the throat, which we also call the airway. Now, this can lead to a number of very negative consequences and risks to your health, ranging from being sleepy and fatigued to exacerbating things like high blood pressure, diabetes, and even to the risk of stroke, uh, increased risk of stroke. So uh, the, the most common uh, treatment typically offered is a continuous positive airway pressure device or a CPAP mask, which a lot of people are familiar with, but this can be quite a challenging uh, treatment to tolerate. And what we found is that part of the cause of obstructive sleep apnea is excessive relaxation of the muscles of the throat or airway. And that's precisely what the Inspire device or uh, the upper airway stimulator is designed to help with. It's designed to help improve that muscle tone while it's on in a patient who's sleeping with obstructive sleep apnea. So tell us, how, how does the patient get the device? How does it work once it's uh, in our system? If the Inspire device or upper airway stimulator device is thought to be something that will help you, we'll offer it to the patient and um, obviously involve the patient very closely in decision making to make sure it's the right thing for them. Um, ultimately, if, if this is the right treatment for somebody, they will have a surgical procedure where the device is implanted. Um, part of the device is implanted to the upper chest under the collarbone on the right side. And another part of the device or the stimulating lead is implanted in the neck around a nerve that actually helps contract or tense that musculature that I am talking about uh, to improve the muscle tone of the throat. And I should mention that Highland Hospital is the first center of excellence for the Inspire device in the Northeast. In your medical opinion, just how successful is the Inspire device once implemented? You know, it's been um, actually very successful for our patients. Um, and part of the reason that we're honored actually to be named a center of excellence is the volume of patients that we've treated and treated successfully and the outcomes that we've been able to accomplish for our patients. The goal is um, to reduce your sleep apnea very significantly or eliminate sleep apnea. And in most cases, we can accomplish those goals um, and really help people out. Improving sleep and really improving health as well. Doctor, we really appreciate the time. Thank you. For more information about the Inspire device, it's inspiresleep.com. We'll share that link on our site as well at rochesterfirst.com.